Have you ever wondered what it takes to outsmart a criminal mastermind? Well today we're going to delve into the mind of one of television's most memorable detectives, Columbo. Now Columbo isn't your typical sharp-suited, fast-talking detective. No, he's quite the opposite, in fact. With his rumpled raincoat, a cigar often clutched in his hand, and a seemingly absent-minded demeanor, he's easy to underestimate. But that's where the genius of Columbo really shines. Beneath the disheveled exterior lies a razor-sharp mind, capable of picking apart the most intricate of crimes. His approach to crime-solving? It's not about the chase, the gunfights, or the flashy forensics. Instead, it's all about the details, the tiny inconsistencies that others might overlook. That's where Columbo excels. So, stick around as we peel back the layers and understand what makes Columbo a detective like no other. Observation, the key to Columbo's success. Now, let's delve a little deeper into the mind of our favorite detective. Columbo's observational skills are nothing short of extraordinary. His ability to notice the minutest details, the ones that most would overlook, is what sets him apart. Whether it's a slightly off-kilter picture frame or an unusual choice of words, Columbo has the uncanny ability to pick up on these anomalies. He doesn't just see, he observes. Every detail, no matter how insignificant it may seem, is a piece of the puzzle that he meticulously puts together. This keen sense of observation extends beyond physical clues. Columbo has a knack for reading people, understanding their motivations, and discerning the truth from a weave of deception. His incisive questions and seemingly casual conversations are all part of his methodical approach. And so, with his sharp eye, nothing escapes Columbo's notice. This is the power of observation, the cornerstone of Columbo's detective genius. Now let's dive into one of Columbo's most intriguing cases. Picture this. A high-profile murder that has left the police stumped. The crime scene is immaculate, no fingerprints, no weapon, and the alibi of the prime suspect is watertight. It seems like the perfect crime, doesn't it? But not for Columbo. As Columbo steps into the scene, he doesn't start with the obvious. Instead, he focuses on the minutia, a speck of dust on a bookshelf, a slightly moved piece of furniture, a half-drunk cup of coffee. To the untrained eye, these details might seem insignificant, but for Columbo, they're the pieces of a complex puzzle. Columbo's interrogation style is far from the good cop, bad cop routine. He's friendly, even affable. He chats with the suspect, lulling them into a sense of security. As they relax, they start to slip, revealing tiny inconsistencies in their alibi or behavior. Take for instance the case where the suspect claimed he was at a concert at the time of the murder. Columbo noticed the suspect was wearing glasses yet he had no glasses case. Strange for someone who'd been out all evening at a concert, right? This seemingly trivial detail was the loose thread that Columbo needed to unravel the suspect's carefully woven alibi. While the forensic team was still searching for fingerprints and DNA, Columbo was already closing in on the killer. His weapon? His understanding of human nature. He knew people make mistakes and under the right pressure, they crack. And that's exactly what happened. The suspect, underestimating Columbo's intellect, let his guard down and incriminated himself. Columbo's approach to solving crimes is not about brute force or high-tech gadgets, it's about understanding human nature. He doesn't just solve crimes, he unravels them, thread by thread, until the truth is laid bare. And that, folks, is the genius of Columbo. What makes Columbo's approach to crime solving so unique? Well, it's all about the rapport. Instead of coming across as a stern and intimidating figure, Columbo presents himself as affable and non-threatening. This disarmingly charming demeanor allows him to build a rapport with suspects who often underestimate him as a result. But this is precisely where they err. Columbo's seeming simplicity is his greatest weapon. He uses it to lead suspects into a false sense of security, strategically allowing them to reveal crucial information. At the heart of it all, Columbo's investigations are not just about finding the evidence, they are psychological operations, designed to understand the criminal's mind better and anticipate their next moves. He listens, he observes, and he waits for the perfect moment to strike. As we've seen time and again, Columbo's investigations are a chess game of intellect, and he's always several moves ahead. Scene script, let's hear what some of you, our fellow detectives, have to say about Columbo. First up, we have a comment from Sherlock's Apprentice who says, Columbo's charm is his understated genius, he's a master at playing the fool to catch the wise, his disheveled appearance is his greatest weapon. Couldn't agree more, Sherlock's apprentice. Columbo's unconventional tactics certainly set him apart from his peers. Next we have Miss Marple's niece, who notes, What I love about Columbo is his humility. Despite his brilliance, he never brags about his abilities. It's always about justice, not ego. Well said, Miss Marple's niece. 
Columbo's humility is indeed a refreshing change from the typical brash detective trope. Finally, Poirot's prodigy shares, Columbo's strength lies in his understanding of human nature. He can read people like a book, and that's what makes him a great detective. Absolutely, Poirot's prodigy. Understanding human nature is a crucial aspect of crime solving and Columbo is a master at it. Thank you fellow detectives for your insightful comments. It's clear that Columbo's unique approach to crime solving has left a lasting impact on all of us. His genius lies not in flashy gadgets or brute force, but in his keen observation skills and understanding of human nature. In this video, we've delved into Columbo's character, analyzed one of his classic cases, and discussed his unique techniques. We've seen how his seemingly absent-minded demeanor is a strategic approach to catch criminals off guard. We've observed his knack for noticing the smallest details, and his ability to read people like an open book. In conclusion, Columbo's legacy continues to inspire crime-solving enthusiasts around the world. His character teaches us that crime-solving is not just about physical evidence, but also about understanding the human psyche. It's a game of intellect where the sharpest mind wins. Columbo's legacy lives on, inspiring crime-solving enthusiasts. Until next time, keep your magnifying glasses handy and your mind sharp.